guys, Rudy here and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm so excited to share to you guys all the things that I bought for my trip to Hong Kong. So enough of the talking, let's get started. To start off, if you guys will look for my Hong Kong vlog, I'm really sorry guys but I did not vlog when I was there because I just want to enjoy every single moment that I was there which I really did and of course I did a bit of shopping actually I did not get a lot of stuff unlike my trip before because um, this was my second time to visit Hong Kong but I bought like a few stuff only but you guys might think that it is still a lot but actually it is not and also guys I'm not bragging in any way in any form so I'm not really bragging I just want to show you guys and give you some idea of what to get when you visit Hong Kong and also I hope you guys won't mind if I share to you guys the prices because I know some of you guys will ask me what is the price of this one what is the price of that one so I just want to include all the prices that I got so that um, you would know and also you will have idea like for example you want this thing and you want to go to Hong Kong or you're about to go to Hong Kong so you will have idea what the price is so I hope you guys don't mind that and I hope you guys won't see or won't think that I am bragging that's why I'm telling the prices alright so let's divide this video maybe place by place so let's start off with this two mascaras I know you guys are very familiar with this this is the heroin make I got the volume and curl mascara and also I got the long and curl mascara I got this for 75 Hong Kong dollars and then another one it's 75 Hong Kong dollars I forgot the name of the store I did not get this from Sasa, Buncher or Color Mix I got this from a store in Chim Shachi Chim Shachi so it's um, I guess around Granville Road so there are stores there and also they are selling perfume so maybe if you guys visit Chimshatcher and you happen to go to uh, Granville Road and then you can see a store that is selling um, perfumes and you might go and check it out because you might find this um, mascaras but actually you can uh, find this in Sasa, Bonjour, Color Make so you don't have to worry so I got this too. Then the next one, I went to Mong Kok because the first time I went to Hong Kong, Mong Kok is my favorite place. And up until now, it's still my favorite place because they have everything that I need. Like they have Forever 21, different Korean stores, clothing stores, the latest market is there. The Argyle Center is there, which is really my favorite. So uh, while I was walking around Mong Kok, I saw the same the same store which I'm really happy because I heard so many good reviews about this product which is the um, cover perfection tip concealer from the same so it looks like this one okay you guys see it so it looks like that so I got two shades I got the one which is I'm not really sure what shade is that but it says here zero one and then also I got the 1.5 so I got this for 90 Hong Kong dollars for two already so I think it's really a good price and also guys before I continue um, before I went to Hong Kong of course I had my money changed so the conversion would be one Hong Kong dollar is equivalent to 6.68 Philippine Peso. So the time that I went there, that is the conversion. Next one, I went to the Kiko Milano branch in Mong Kong. So I got two products, of course. I will not miss Kathleen Light's favorite mascara. This is the Kiko Milano Extra Sculpt Volume Mascara. So it looks like this. I did not get this on sale. So it looks like this one. It's very classy. I love the design. I love the packaging of this product. So uh, I did not get this on sale. But when I went to the Kiko Milano branch in Mong Kok, uh, some of the products are on sale. But this one, it's not on sale. I got this for 99 Hong Kong dollars, the mascara. And then also I got myself the MAC Mousse Oil-Free Foundation from Kiko Milano, of course, as well. So it looks like, they, oh, looks like this one. 
So of course they have oily skin and then it is oil free so I love this one. I will not open this product yet guys. I'm really sorry for that because I still have a lot of foundation to finish, a lot of product to finish. So once I open this of course after 12 months I have to dispose it and I only have one face. I have to finish the pro some of the products first then I will definitely try this one. But I got the shade 02 Light Pro. Also guys, I got this foundation for 145 Hong Kong dollars. Moving on to the next place, of course, I will not miss going to Sasa. So I decided to get some stuff there. So I went to the Sasa Supreme and Sasa Supreme in Chimshatcher. So if you guys go to Chimshatcher, make sure you check the Sasa Supreme because I asked the SA there and she said that that is the biggest Sasa. But actually when I went there, I only got a few stuff. Um, don't worry guys because Sasa is everywhere in Hong Kong. Like every block you can find Sasa so you don't have to worry because we just happened to go to Chimshatcher so I decided to go to Sasa Supreme. So now I will just get things randomly. So for the first brand, I got myself a BB cream from Heroin Make. So it looks like this. Again guys, I'm really sorry I will not open this one yet. But I believe it has one shade only because when I went to their counter, it has one shade. So I believe it's only one shade. But yeah, so... It is the BB cream. It has SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 and it got this for 69 Hong Kong dollars. The next product I got this also from Heroin Make. It is like a primer. So it's the Make Lasting Base. It's in matte keep. So it has SPF 50 plus plus PA plus 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 as well. So it is also for 69 dollars. For the next product, this is one of the reasons why I wanted to visit Sasa. This is the brand Bourgeois. So I got myself the Healthy Mix Serum Gel Foundation. So this is for 198 Hong Kong dollars. Next one I got myself from Bourgeois as well. It is the Air Matte. Oh uh, yeah, Air Matte. And I got it for 178 Hong Kong dollars. Looks like this one. And then the last one from Bourgeois, I got myself the Bourgeois Healthy Balance um, Matte Finish and Natural Healthy Glow Powder. So I got this one for 128 Hong Kong dollars. Looks like this. For the next one, I got myself the Evian Spray, which I really love because I only have this small one and I already finished that product. So I got myself a bigger one and I got this for... Oh, where is it? I, I believe I got this for 55 Hong Kong dollars, which I find really cheap. And for the last product that I bought from the Sassy Supreme, I got myself the Nature Republic Soothing and Moisture Aloe Vera 92% Soothing Gel. You guys know how much I love this one. I got myself two from Sasa Supreme. So I got this only for 18 Hong Kong dollars. So sobrang cheap neto. You guys should get a lot of these when you visit Hong Kong. And then when I was about to leave Sasa Supreme, the essay called me and she said, I have a freebie maybe because I reached a specific amount. So they got me this Dengi Mori. Dengi Mori. Dengi Mori. It's a Korean bread, I'm pretty sure, because it's, it has Korean characters and it says here premium all-in-one hair care. So when I tried to smell this one, sobrang bango. Ay. And then, funny thing, when I tried to smell this one the moment I got back to our apartment because we just rented an apartment there through Airbnb. So I tried smelling this one and it smells so good and then what we did, I asked my brother and also Ryan to go with me and then we checked every single Sasa as well as Bonjour if they have this one but unfortunately I did not find anything like this so next time I will get a lot of this. And then another freebie from Sasa Supreme, I got this one. It's a, it is a ribbon turban so I can definitely use this when I'm doing my makeup or maybe skincare at night. For the next door, I went to Color Mix and I got two bags. So, so this bag is full of skincare products and this bag is full of makeup. I actually did not get a lot of makeup from Color Mix because I already got a lot of makeup from Sasa. So 
So to start off, I'm really really happy with the thing that I got from Color Mix. I'm so happy because I decided to go there. It's just near our Airbnb. So I got myself this Clio Professional Kill Cover Conceal Cushion and I got this only for 125 Hong Kong dollars which is around 800 uh, plus pesos in the Philippines. So I got this almost half the price here in the Philippines. So yeah i got this one the next product it is still a product from bourgeois i got this um contour clubbing waterproof eyeliner i heard this product because of um at the end clutes so she likes this product so much she uses this for uh, tight lining her eyes i'm so excited to try this one i got myself a two this is for 62 Hong Kong dollars each. 62 Hong Kong dollars each. So moving on to the next bag. This bag is full of Korean skincare products. So let's start. So the first one here is the Skin Food Black Sugar Mask Wash Off. A lot of um, Korean YouTubers as well as um, other YouTubers like this product so much so I decided to get this one. I got this for 55 Hong Kong dollars. So for the next product, I heard this because of Ade. Um, at the Rage Ramos here on YouTube so she likes this um, line so much this is from the face shop rice water bright rich cleansing oil and it got also the rice water bright cleansing milk so I got this product for 110 Hong Kong dollars yeah 110 Hong Kong dollars and then and then the another one is 110 Hong Kong dollars the next product it's still from the face shop this is my holy holy grail uh, toner so this is the clean face line it is the mild toner it has tea tree leaf extract actually sometimes I find it so mild that sometimes I don't think it does a great job on my skin but actually it does so I decided to pick up this one because it's only for if I'm not mistaken it's only for 50 Hong Kong dollars so it's roughly around 300 plus but in the Philippines it's around 600 plus the next product it is from the Ines free brand it is a super uh, super volcanic pore clay mask let me just open this to you guys so so it looks like this one so I got this one for 55 Hong Kong dollars as well. So for the last one that I got from Color Mix, again, this is the Nature Republic Soothing Gel. So I got this too for um, 34 Hong Kong dollars for two. So the Malabasna is 17 Hong Kong dollars each, which is a dollar cheaper than the price from Sasa. So I decided to get this one. So I already have four. So that's all the things that I got from Color Mix. Moving on to the next brand. So I got myself some stuff from H&M. I know we have this brand in the Philippines, but when we check out H&M, they are on sale. So I decided to get some stuff. So the first one, I decided to get myself a pants from H&M. So it looks like this one so it says here it is a slacks which I think it is so it fits me so well so I got this only for 100 Hong Kong dollars but the original price is 299 Hong Kong dollars so the next one it is a crop hoodie I saw this one the day before I leave the Philippines going to Hong Kong so it is the purpose the world tour crop um, hoodie so I'm so excited because I only got this on sale the original price is 249 Hong Kong dollars but I only got this for 100 Hong Kong dollars so of course when going to a clothing store I will not miss going to the men's area so I decided to get myself a, just a plain t-shirt so it's like a perfect go-to shirt and I got this for 49.90 Hong Kong dollars I like this color so much and then I also got myself the same with the orange one this is still also for 49.90 Hong Kong dollars so it's like a fuchsia pink yeah so I like this one but the difference of H&M in Hong Kong and H&M here in the Philippines is that we don't have the makeup line here in the Philippines and the Hong Kong 
they have it so I decided to pick up a powder so it is the true matte finishing powder shine control cashmere finish wow cashmere finish so the packaging looks like this one it looks so classy so when you open this so it has a mirror and then here is your powder so I got this only for 50 Hong Kong dollars because it was on sale so the original price is 99.90 Hong Kong dollars but I got this for $50 only moving on to the next item that I got so I got this from the ladies market it is located in Hong Kong this is like a silk maybe a satin robe so it looks like this it's super long it is a perfect cover-up especially when you are just wearing like a sleeveless top so you can just um, put this on so it will add up uh, some spice to your outfit so I decided to get this one actually guys one tip when you are going to Hong Kong especially when you go to their market you have to haggle um, this one, the real price of this is 180, oh no, 190 Hong Kong dollars, but I find it really expensive for a market price. So I said that, no, I will get this only for 80, so 80 Hong Kong dollars, and she said that, give me more, give me more, so no, I will just get this for 80. And then when I was about to leave the market, or I mean her stall, so she held my hand and she said, okay, okay, 80, okay. I got this for 80 Hong Kong dollars. That is the only thing that I got for myself from the ladies market. We actually bought some stuff there, like the common souvenir stuff. But um, for me, I did not go crazy when I went to the ladies market, unlike what I did before, like every single store, like feeling ko kailangan ko lahat sila, but... I did not do it this time so I just got myself that one. It is actually part of my shopping list like when I go to the ladies market that is the thing that I should not miss to buy. Next one, let's go to the Argyle Center. Argyle Center would be my favorite, 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 favorite place to shop when I go to Hong Kong. So I love going to Argyle Center because they all have the trendy clothes, the, pla the bags, the blacks, the bags, the shoes, and so on and so forth. They also have makeup there. And also they have skincare products and all that good stuff. So if you guys go to Hong Kong and if you want to get trendy clothes with a much cheaper price, so go to uh, Argyle Center. It is located in Omong Kong. So let's start off with the first one. So I got this curtain. So it's only for 10 Hong Kong a dollar. So I got this one. So it looks like this at the back. For the next one, I got a few things from a specific store. I forgot the name of it, but it is located um, third level of Argyle Center. So I got this um, like a dress, but it's, you know, your typical dress. And then, I mean, your typical shirt. So you put on the shirt first and then you can put on like a dress. So it looks like this. It's like a lazy dress. The next one is almost the same thing with the first one. So it's your dress. So you can just put it on top of your white plain shirt. And then I got another thing which is the same with that one. You have your typical white shirt. Which I will not open and then this is like a ma'ong sleeveless um, dress so it's a black ma'ong so I love it, this one so much so it's kind of an even here next one I got myself a long sleeve of polo so it's it looks like this one so I think it's very cute it looks very casual and I got this in different color so and also with different style but it's um, it's the same thing. It's a polo shirt, long sleeves of polo. So it looks like this one. It's black and white. So it looks like this. So I'm really sorry guys because I will not do like a try on haul because I'm pretty sure you will find it on my future videos like maybe outfit videos and at the same time you can see it on my Instagram so make sure you follow me on Instagram it's at by Rudy as well. Next one I got myself I don't know how to call this top but it looks like this one 
So I have the top in different colors. The color of this one is like uh, pink. Uh, it's a shade of pink, but I'm not really sure what shade of pink it is because I'm really bad when it comes to describing colors but it looks like this one I think it's pretty cool it's pretty cute and for the second to the last thing that I got from the Argyle Center again I did not go gaga I did not go crazy over shopping when I went to Argyle Center which I kind of regret right now but yeah well anyway I still love everything that I got so it's the same thing sorry it's the same thing with the sleeve, I mean for the white shirt and then you can put on a dress. I really like that kind of style recently because I think it's really, um, it's really cute, it's really good. So I decided to get myself a gray one. So it's a long, very long dress and it's, it looks like this in front. And for the last thing that I got from the Argyle Center, I got myself the Batiste. It's Batiste, right? So it's the dry shampoo. So I got the floral and flirty blush. Yeah. When you smell it here, it smells so bad. But actually, <laughs> when you try to spray it, oh, it smells so good. So yeah, I got this one for 35 Hong Kong dollars. Oh, I forgot the prices of the dresses. The dresses are 80 Hong Kong dollars. The denim dress, the black denim dress, it is 50 Hong Kong dollars. And then for the tops, they are all 70 Hong Kong dollars. For the last part of my Hong Kong haul, I bought some snacks from Okashi Land and Price Mart. So, uh, it's very big. Oh, okay. So this bag is full of snacks. So I will just put this down. So let's start off with all the snacks that I got from Okashi Land. So I got this crispy peanut waffle. I got the next one, the crispy egg waffle. So it looks like this. And then the last one, I got the crispy egg waffle as well. So these three boxes, they are made in Hong Kong, which I really love because I wanted to try their local snacks. So I decided to pick up this one. So I believe um, this is like buy two, get one free. And this three costs 170 Hong Kong dollars. And then for the next one, I got this um, Koala's March Chocolate and Strawberry Family Pack. It has 10 packs inside, so it looks like this. I believe it. this one is 29, yeah, 29 Hong Kong dollars or 25 Hong Kong dollars, not more than 30 Hong Kong dollars. So I got this one. The next one, I got the Pipero. I got the Almond and Chocolate and also the white cookie one so i actually got two of each but we already ate them so yeah this one and each box costs 22 hong kong dollars and then for the last thing actually this is a freebie this is from the brand bourbon yeah bourbon i don't know what is this called but it looks like this i got this for free maybe because i reached a specific amount so for the last one, I'll be showing you guys all the chocolates and all the knickknacks that I got from um, Price Mart. The Price Mart that we went to, it is located in Central. So starting off, I got this um, pieces. So it is the milk chocolate one. Sorry, medyo mamasama Sasha. It looks kind of wet because I just got this out from the refrigerator. So yeah, so it looks like this one and I got this only for 36 Hong Kong dollars so for the next one I got this crunch so this is the milk chocolate with crisp rice so it looks like this I got this one for 26 oh it's 26 yeah it's 26 Hong Kong dollars moving on I got two bars of Cadbury dairy milk this is the fruit and nuts so I got two and each cost Oh, I forgot but I'm pretty sure it's not more than 20 Hong Kong dollars it's between 15 to 20 Hong Kong dollars so I got this one I'm really sorry guys because I lost the receipt already but moving on I got two packs of Toblerone the first one is the white one and then 
your typical milk chocolate. Yeah, the milk chocolate one. So I actually got a four of this one, but I gave them a specific long and then this one as well. So each uh, each pack costs 16 Hong Kong dollars. And then for the next one, I got uh, Maltesiers. So it looks like this one. It costs 8.60. I'm pretty sure with that, it's 8.60 Hong Kong dollars. I actually have to left i bought six of this one but we already ate them so that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed my hong kong haul thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i would really really appreciate it and i will see you on my next video bye guys